Hi everybody, Rebecca here. Today I want to make some tags and I'm going to use these cool images from Work, Work Basket magazines. I don't know if you know what those are. They're, mine are from the 50s and I have some from the 40s and I've had these for probably 25 years and they're not particularly valuable and I just don't have the room to keep them anymore so I've been going through and cutting out like um, I'll cut this lady out <laughs> and then some of the ads are pretty funny fall guy I'll be cutting him out so that's what I'm using I'm also using painted papers that I've sprayed with Dilution inks and some recycled packaging from when we made gift baskets at work. Mod Podge, Corner Punch I just got. I'm kind of in love with it. So let's get busy. First thing is I'm going to glue oops don't want to get those wet you got to use a lot of glue it seems like because I like it to be like really stuck on there and then really shiny when you um, seal it I'm going to trim. Uh, what I really like is the little pieces that come off. I use those to decorate with too. So it's like I use everything down to the very last molecule. I've got quite the reputation at work. I earned my crazy Rebecca name <laughs> really good because people are like, why are you taking that? Are you crazy? Huh, yeah, I am. Okay, that's, I don't care if it's wrinkled. It adds to it. Now I'm going to take a contrasting color. Do I like that? What is going on with that? It's got little dots on it. Okay. I guess it's, I guess I'm choosing this one. I'm going to punch with this side. This is called Sea Pearls by Fiskers. trimmed a little. If I was sitting down it would probably have come out a little better. Okay. Oh, and it fell on there. That's okay. That's okay. I like that actually. The little dot thingies fell off onto it. because I don't stop and think. Put 
that down, slap some glue on it. Get that down a little better up there. Okay, now we get to pick our lady. We have, oh, she's a little too big. What about this? Cause she's got yellow on her. I think so. And I also have, like I said, I was cutting out advertising. So I think I'm going to look how about thread a needle in the dark because we know that's important to be able to do. And she looks like, hmm, I hope I can thread my needle in the dark. So I'm going to put this one here. And uh, maybe something different there. Or maybe nothing. So we will put that aside to dry. I have a special drying rack for them. Here's one I made last night. I uh, didn't put anything down here because I kind of like this splotchy thing. And I finished the back too with scraps. So let's punch. If I can find my hole punch. Okay, never mind. I hate when I do that. use the sharp pokey thing. Let's eyeball. It. Oh, that's where the hole was. I, I guessed it right away. And I have these awesome purple yarn scraps. I've been making a I made a purple ruana and a purple blanket and I've been keeping all the little yarny things I cut off because I love purple. This has purple right there so this is going to go good. Maybe a little orange just because I'm weird that way. Very cool tag with a very cool image. Nobody else will have these if you, you know, be the first of your friends. So that's all I have today. I thank you and uh, please subscribe. I need friends. <laughs>